As part of its activity to assist less privileged in society, a non-governmental organization known as Eyes of Arewa in Adamawa State has distributed food items and clothing to vulnerable people and orphans in Yola in order to put smile on their faces ahead of 2022 Christmas celebration. The founder of the organization, Rashida Haman, who led the members of the organization in a distribution of the food item, said it didn't fit for the organization to assist the less privileged in the society, explaining that the program is part of their activity in assisting the less privileged people, especially the orphan in the society. Represented by the director of logistics of the organization, Jacinta Aloysius, the founder explained that giving out the food items and other things to the orphan and the less privileged is one of their programs for humanity, and they did similar programs during the solar period. This, according to her, is to ease the suffering of the orphan and the less privileged who are out of the celebration because of the poverty. We've done so many activities so far, and God has helped us. Like last year, we were able to uh, give out uh, a giveaway to our Muslim brothers who celebrated Salah. We were able to give clothes. We give uh, food items like rice. Some of our girls, we wash their hair with shampoo and the boys, we barb their hair and give them detergents to wash their clothes. And by the special grace of God, this year, December, which is a program we just ran uh, yesterday, we shared rice to some of our sis uh, Christian sisters and brothers who are orphans and uh, some widows. We were able to share rice and to some of our children, we gave them clothes, both boys and girls. She further enumerates some of the achievements of the organization, which include building school with three classrooms for the orphan called Makaranta Marayu in Hausa language, with the aim of eradicating illiteracy among the orphan in the community. Sincerely, God has been faithful. Here is, like we said, is non-profitable organization. We source our funds through ourselves, we task ourselves, like we have a, a, a school which we call uh, Makaranta Marayu. Then we can't thank enough the founder, who is our mommy, Rashida Haman. She has been the one going out to see that this uh, organization is standing firm. So we get a... Uh, finance from ourselves and then from well meaning in Jacinta Aloysius who represented the founder of organization Rashida Haman pointed out some of the contribution the organization is getting from wealthy individual in the society and call on the government at all level and the international organization to support the eyes of Arewa organization in order to save people from poverty and other difficult situations. And then we have some well meaning individual that have been helping us and sincerely we cannot forget to thank our mama Mommy Paweka, she has been of tremendous help to us. Like we have a, a, a school which we call uh, Makaranta Marayu. She has been the one supporting us. We have teachers. She has been helping us to pay our teachers. She has been helping us to, if you look inside our school, you find out that uh, we just fenced the school completely. She has been the pillar. We can't thank her enough. We have some other uh, members in the community that have been helping us. So we are pleading on well-meaning Nigerians, the people in the state of Adama State. We are asking the government to come. Join hands with us. Give us your support so that we'll be able to reach out through the help of individual and government. We can be able to assist them and other international bodies they can also come to our aid with the intervention of the eyes of arewa organization it puts smile on the faces of the orphan and less privileged in the society zayed ismail zich online tv news